Jay and I went out to eat in Puerto Vallarta and had one of the worst meals of my life. So first of all, let me set the stage here. Uh, my partner has uh, issues with processing gluten uh, while we were living in the United States, but she was able to kind of like repair her gut microbiome right before we left. Um, and since uh, she's so used to eating gluten-free, we decided, hey, let's go check out this restaurant in Puerto Vallarta called La, La Bendita Bacaro Sin Copa. Um, I was open to it. it. The menu looked cool. It had meat, even though it was like billed as like gluten-free, um, keto, paleo, and vegan options, but they had meat. So I was like, I'm down to go. So we walked. Did we walk? Yeah, I think we walked there. We walked there from um, where we were staying. It was about like a 25 minute walk. Um, we got to the location. It was really nice. Um, the seating was cute. It had great decoration. It was like really nicely put together. I really enjoyed the vibe. The server was really patient with us because, you know, our Spanish isn't the best and they spoke a little bit of English. So, yeah, they gave us plenty of time to order. And yeah, the menu looked pretty decent. Um, but unfortunately, that's like the only thing that I can say like positively about the experience because frankly, the food was just not good. Um, it was probably one of the worst foods I've ever had in my life, to be honest. <laughs> um, at least eating out. Um, Jay ordered like this bread thing with salmon and sprouts um, and she said the bread was really dry and flavorless. Um, I got waffles and bacon with like chocolate dipping sauce and my waffles were dry um, and the, they tasted like baking soda, like they weren't mixed uh, properly. Um, I also was given burnt bacon, and I mean burnt, like burnt and dry and brittle, like unedible, like I couldn't even finish it. So it was really, really disappointing. Um, and even our drinks were disappointing because all of the drinks had stevia in it. They didn't use sugar. They didn't use honey. Um, and I don't really like artificial sugar, so I asked for no no sugar, basically, and the drinks were just kind of meh to me, in my, my opinion. And then lastly, is the price of the situation so everything was very expensive because you know it's a uh, specialty food um but it wasn't very taste special tasting um and the meal the total you know with everything and i think include might have been including the tip or maybe before the tip was like 50 bucks for two meals and two drinks and i was just like this was not worth it and i'm talking 50 bucks usd okay so uh just a really not a great experience other than like the vibes of the place the food just was not it was wasn't good um so then afterwards after the meal we were down the street from one of my favorite family restaurants and we decided to just walk on over there and i could like fill up on some good food that i you know was comfortable with so we walked you know three four blocks down the street to la cumbe and i got my usual order of a shrimp sandwich with chicken caesar salad and uh, jay ordered like a chai drink or something like that and it was absolutely delicious it was everything that i expected and remembered so we went to la bandito or something bandito bandito do you remember the name of it it doesn't matter we went to this place it's like gluten-free vegan dairy-free and it was not very good um i got we got a can a shrimp sandwich a panini so yeah so we went to this place and we got a shrimp panini sandwich which was actually pretty good the, yeah. Oh, the shrimp was good, but then I got uh, waffles and bacon, and the bacon was burnt to a crisp, couldn't even eat it, and the waffles didn't taste very good, and Jay got salmon and, uh, salmon and what? Salmon toast? Yeah. Salmon toast, which the bread was not very good either. It's just because it was like, not only was it gluten-free, it was also vegan-free and dairy-free, and it just didn't taste very good, and, um... It was $45 for all, and we got lemonadas, but they only had stevia for sugar. They didn't even have like brown sugar. <laughs> so uh, for me, I was very disappointed because I'm like $45 for food that wasn't very tasty and, and burnt. <laughs> burnt food is like, what are you doing? Why are you serving people burnt food? But anyway, uh, but we were still, we didn't complain. We gave a tip, which I don't think we should have, but we did. <laughs> Uh, and we left and now we're at Lacumbe, my favorite place and I'm getting a proper shrimp sandwich with a salad and it's gonna be delicious because yeah, we should just come here but Jay wanted to go to a new place a new healthy place well, I always want to try something that says it's gluten-free and I don't think I'm gonna do that anymore <laughs> I don't think you should we should not try gluten-free places it's just not worth it it's not tasty enough and it costs too much it costs too much it's not and I can eat the wheat here. Yes, you can eat the wheat here, so, so why? There's no need for me to avoid anything. Yeah. So yeah, now we're, we're at Lukumbe and I'm waiting for my 
shrimp sandwich with uh, chicken salad. Hopefully she got that right because he came back to ask me what my order was again. Oh yeah. I think, oh, hopefully. We'll see. Not tasty. <laughs> excited for a celiac safe because it's a completely gluten-free kitchen right which is hard to find if you're celiac right so but, but it wasn't tasty as yeah they wanted to like it but the food was just not good <laughs> i would agree with that <laughs> did anyone get burnt food <laughs> very pricey for what you get yep i would agree with that yeah the price too high and not worth it But I think a lot of the people that are making the good reviews are for people who have like severe dietary restrictions. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know, if you're looking for a celiac friendly kitchen, it's probably one of the few places that you'll be able to go to. In a country, yeah. in the world. <laughs> like, it's just not and a thing. Celiac, so and I don't need, need to. that. Mm -hmm. God, getting what I want. Yes. Deliciousness. Yes. Yeah, that was Bomb. amazing.